Did I just literally dump that all over the ground? I blame my camera. Hundred percent. Still salty about that one bucket. Yeah, rip the truck. Okay, so we're gonna see what this vote is. Yeah, it must be a Ford. <laughs> it's like a rock. It's like a rock, it's built for tough. Heavy like a rock. Hope that was good. Yeah, you can see that one's down. This is my dumb ass. Okay, let's check and see what it is. I have a feeling I already know. Ah, oh, 68.2 say spend, 31.8% say save. They want me to go massively, massively into debt. That is now closed. Our comfy little setup that we got here, and you guys want me to break it all. Oh, buckets of balls. Buckets of balls. I'll tell you, we had a nice thing going here. We had a nice... Look at that. That's a pretty good hole we dug. I mean, we did. We dug pretty good down in there. We'll probably end up with eight. Between these two buckets, we'll have eight. Hit a post. This is going to definitely take us down, though. I don't know how far it's going to get us. Close enough, I'll carry these things. Well, we'll head over there and check it out. We'll dump this big bucket in there first. Go out here and gotta turn everything on. All right, there we go. Try to get this bucket here if we can. Why not number no go up? That would make sense. Alright, now she's going up. Forgot to start that one. The, all this stuff's gonna have to get moved because this is where that big stuff gets set up. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll slam our tailgate. And I'll bring these buckets back. We'll drop them off. And then we will hit a holy buckets, I forgot about that hole. Oh my god, I forgot about the e-brake. <laughs> we should get some tow ropes over here before we get our truck stuck. Oh, this is bad. Well, that's not good. 
got to be careful what we throw around here. Throwing these buckets around. We'll go stack this one right here. Did I, did I unload? Oh, the one fell through. Okay, I got it. All right, there we go. You didn't pull start the pump. Yep. All right. I pushed the off button because I was a dumb dumb. Thought I went over and did something to it. All right, what do we get? 7.92. Looks like it's done. All right, to shy of eight. Oh, you guys really want me to take out a fat freaking loan. What's the gold bars at? Um, they're not the greatest right now. How about we sleep and maybe they'll be better the next day? You know what I mean? Because it's like already nighttime. Well, it's not quite nighttime. Damn it, what do we do? We could always... Can't do that. Okay, what do we do? Do we go sell the gold or should we try to sleep? So much to remember, you didn't... Okay, you voted spend. <laughs> so you guys are saying to go sleep? I'm thinking that... Maybe the gold prices will come up. They're kind of down right now. No, there is no multiplayer. What do you guys think? Got one person saying sleep. Save? Yeah, it actually would be a good time for that. Take the loan, then sleep. We'll do not have to pay on it earlier. We'll save first. We'll double check our save. Yep, 510, okay. All right, here we go. Check these gold prices out. And they didn't really change, did they? Same thing, isn't it? I don't, actually, the look at this. 1188, 11... That doesn't really... That's not really, you know... Eh. That's not enough to worry about. Oh, you guys... I'm going to take out this loan. You think the whole thing? A thousand dollars, eighteen hundred dollars a day. What are we gonna spread it out over? Sixty days. Oh, that's. Wait, how many installments? Daily charge. Oh, my payments would only be four grand a day. That would require it all being paid back by the next day. Um, really, you guys think we should go in that much? Do 10,000? Do 60 day? 60 day loan. Smelt the gold. Well, the gold's going to be added in. It'll probably give us, you know, right about two, what? 225 to 230. We'll be right around 230,000. But that's it. I mean, we got what we got here. They're saying do 60 day loan for the whole thing. Take out the whole thing. Load old when done. With big fat loan. 60 days. Okay, we're going to go ahead and take the loan out. Ay, 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 uh, Copenhagen, what's happening? Uh, uh. Ah! 
Oh my god, what the hell is wrong with you people? You guys are freaking nuts. I don't even know what I need. I'm gonna go sell my gold. You know what? Maybe we shouldn't sell the gold. Maybe we should hold on to our gold so that if we're in a real pinch, we don't we don't want to spend everything and be like, I can't even buy a bucket because I, you know, don't have any money. Uh, maybe we should go s spend that money to see how far it can get us first. I feel like we should get a fuel trailer. I feel like we should be getting the um, the fuel trailer. I feel like we should be getting the, the other little Dewey. The magnetite trailer. I feel like those things should be on our list. Where did I get the money? I just took out a loan, yeah. I just took out the big loan. I just took out the whole freaking caboodle of a loan. 221,000 and I had 948. So, ay ay ay. Our payments are gonna be nuts. Oh, I hope this is the right decision. Because we didn't, like, some of this convenience stuff we haven't even gotten yet. You know what I mean? I mean, are you guys cool with that? Do you think that's what we should be doing? Get this mobile fuel tank? We're not dealing with the gas cans and whatnot? Like, get this and then, uh, possibly, you know, and then get this other trailer? Because if you look in the journal in Tier 2... It tells us to get that thing. Well, you know, it, it says it in there somewhere. It, it helps you make some money. Um, tier 3, Shaker, Trommel, Jig. <laughs> the sluice boxes, it makes me think of juice boxes and the big power generator. We've already got the wave table. And then we have to put all those things together. All those things have to get put together. So you basically load the pater to the wash plant. Take the full bucket from duplex jig, pour pay dirt into the wave table. I don't really understand how that whole thing quite works yet, but we'll figure it out. What do you guys think of that? That's going to be, you know, what we're going to have to do. The water hose, so there's your shaker, wash plant. Big generator. Tier 3, wash plant, get the trailer in the fuel tank. You go tier three, go tier three. All right. Uh, cog wheels, batteries. Do not leave your pickup truck with the lights turned on while the engine is off. See, right now, we haven't been dealing with this. I think this is going to be an update. And we're going to be busting springs and teeth and hoses and tracks and chains and all kinds of parts. Mm -mm -mm. The machine park, gas station, and the blacksmith. Okay, so that's kind of the rundown on hiring workers we won't be doing yet. <clears throat> All right, let's 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 get this. And should we get one of these things here? We need one of these, right? We should buy one of these. It's like we, we could have been using it already to, to like get some stuff that we've been basically letting go all over the ground. That right there is going to cost us 11800 
the hiring workers is a joke. I for my little bit of testing, it didn't even work right 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 now. I don't know if you're gonna use this thing with the new the separator. Let me see. Look at this. In tier three it tells you uh tier three it tells you to take to the from the duplex jig to the wave table right so we're not using that uh the magnet the magnetity anymore right if i'm so then we wouldn't want that thing correct because i don't see that anywhere in here it says turn on the power generator get the get the shaker shaken goes through the wash plant dumps into the duplex jig which is going to fart some into the buckets and then the buckets we're going to take to the wash plant to the the wave table and then get the bars out of it that's tier three basically making tier two obsolete do you understand what i'm saying that's just from what i'm gathering um new front loader and wash plant could you rent out new land? Yes, you can. New land? I, I mean, should we really, should we set up a whole new thing? Should we set up a whole new claim? Like, just like, like almost like we're starting over, like right into tier three. That would be, that could be something we could work on. I kind of like that idea, actually. I actually do kind of like that idea in a way setting you know that's what we could do we wouldn't be able to get it up and going today but we could work on getting that done well yeah do but set up get the next claim and go tier three with it yeah it's like tier one on a large scale yeah is there a way to automate the actual gold extracting or do you always have to pause the operation no the wave table the wave table brother sister this thing it, oh my god so well worth the six grand you dump the stuff in you have to have water and electricity hooked up on the other side you flip the switch and you crack the valve crack the valve right there that red valve you crack that to let the water through you flip the switch to let the electric go you walk up, you dump the bucket in, and you walk away, and it just puts everything in your inventory. It is so damn nice. You don't have to sit there panning for the gold anymore. Get the wave table. Six grand, baby. Yes. All right. So from what I'm understanding, I'm going to buy this because I want to have a Tier 2 setup. I want to have a full Tier 2 setup at that other claim. We're going to we're going to do this different. You guys are making me spend money. I took the loan. We're going to go set up a new claim with tier 3. If we don't have enough money to get it running, we're going to work the tier 2 one to get it going. And we're going to go with the big excavator and we're going to get the some of the, the big equipment. That's what we're going to do. That's what we're going to do. All right? I didn't buy that crap yet. Hold on. I I like that. Whole new claim. And we'll work that one over too. And people come in here and they want to see tier 2 stuff. There you go. It's a full tier 2. And we'll have to share the mobile fuel tank. So therefore I'm going to take... Whoops. Oh my god, I can't squeeze through there. I am stuck. Oh, this is awkward. Oh no! Oh no! Um... Oh, thank God. This is really not my day. 
Oh, for Frank's... What the... F I think the truck rolled backwards again. I don't think that's going to work. All right, let's try this. So this isn't going to be any use. And the tier three from what I'm understanding. Oh my God, backup cameras. I have one in my truck. It would be so nice here. There we go. I can smell my dinner being cooked. It is, mm, I want to eat so bad. I think what we're going to do, I'm really tempted to do some more tonight. Just because I, I don't want to push it off till next week. It'll be a mistake. Okay, don't do a new claim. Two people I've seen do it. The whole game started glitching out about two frames and they had to backtrack on an old save. Really? Just getting a new claim completely causes the whole thing to go to take a crap? I don't know, what the hell? Just going to a new claim. What What about our group of people that have been testing beyond? Mr. Ford, what about the rest of you? And TeamSpeak, have you guys run into this problem? To just do tier three out at the current site? I know, I got a video I've got to get edited tonight though. Come on, baby, we're pulling like crazy. Come on! Because, I mean, you can't... You can't throw this equipment away, right? The equipment is not something that you can, like, sell. There's no way to sell it. So if you have all this stuff, you know, wouldn't it be kind of nice to use it? Especially if they do get the worker thing going on. It would be nice to be able to hire a worker to run some some things actually I could have left that alone I have the brake on I don't know why it's rolling See, this goes over here now 1%. So, I mean, it's going to take a while, but hey, it's money, right? Money, money, money. It's going to roll back in. Make sure it doesn't roll into the hole. One thing we do need to get, as I said before, is those straps. All right, I think so. We did that there. We dumped that in there. Okay, let's go get the fuel trailer and get that full. And you know what else we're going to do? Okay, so let's go back and get... Let's go back and, and uh, pick up a rope uh, for towing. You know, if we need to lift the truck out or something. And since we made her this far... I'm going to save again. That way we're good. This game is more important than a video. What if, what if I, what if, oh man. What if, what if I stream this again tomorrow, which, you know, I'm in three and a half years, I can count on probably one hand how many times on a Sunday we did something other than farming. I know it's happened, but it's probably been like a couple of times and it was probably like two years ago the last time we did. Um, 
What if I did this tomorrow and we pushed farming off and we did farming like during the week and tomorrow could be like, cause today we did tier two, tomorrow could be like the tier three stuff. I think it'd be, a, I think, I think it'd be good. I think it'd be good. And we can, we can knock on the farming, you know, um, maybe sneak a stream into that Monday night and then we'll just not do anything on Wednesday. Cause Wednesday's like the first day of spring anyway. Uh, there'll be a lot to do on the farm though. I have some video editing that needs to be done. I've got a couple videos that are in the pipe waiting, so gotta gotta keep my YouTube channel going. Gotta keep the food on the table. Dev's answering lots of questions in Steam forums. Said selling coming soon. Okay, good, good. I don't want to sell like a lot of things. Some things I do, but like I kind of like having the whole tier two setup going here too. I I, I kind of like that. Um, I would sell my, in that pan, I hate that thing. I want to kill it. I'd probably sell that too because I'm mad. But, um, let's pick up, uh, these are pretty cheap. Let's pick up, let's, let's, uh, add 5k rope and let's add a 4. We'll add two of those and we'll get another one of those. And the sevens I've been told are worthless as teats on a boar. So we got those two there. Um, we've I, we've got plenty of buckets. I'm not gonna buy any more buckets. Uh, pretty much we're good to go on all that stuff. Um, if we buy the big generator, then we probably want to set a couple lights up. I do have one light. We'll be back. We can always buy buy more lights because I've got one that I'm not really using right now. So if we go in here and we go tier through, they say buy the shaker, the trommel, the duplex, the duplex jig, the sluice boxes, and big power generator. That's all at the other place. That's all at the other place. But we're gonna need to buy a water pump. A fat hose, a regular hose, and we're going to need to get a couple of hoses, right? We're going to need to get a couple of hoses. So we've got two buckets back there already. I would probably say that. Uh, I don't really tell you, so I'm trying to think of how far I'm going to have to stretch this. <sighs> Alright, let's throw one of these bad boys on there. Can we throw one or two of these on there? Hard to say, because I'm not sure quite where it has to plug in yet. I think we'll be okay. Um... I'm going to throw two of those birds on there, though. Well, no, I can't. I need to take one of those out because you can't hook, can't do that. So let's throw one of those on. Uh, we need to, we need to go over here and throw in one of these water filters. All right. Uh, go right here. Where's that uh, water hose thin? Drop that down like that. Just before I forget. Um, we also need to get, we're probably going to need the fat guy here, won't we? And you know what? I'm going to add another one because they're pretty cheap. And I'm going to add two of these too because it's good to have a couple extras. You know what I'm saying? Um, and, and yeah, so that's, that's what we're going to do. All right. Um, wow, that's pretty awesome. So we got two, two power thin, two fats. I've got connectors if we need them. I've got a water filter, the fat hose, the thin hose, the pump, the four, those, two of two of those, and two of those for in case you know we're gonna need them. We're gonna be lifting stuff up, so we're gonna need that. Um, 
I'm gonna buy this stuff. Only 420 bucks. It seems really cheap. Um, you know these trailers would be really nice because I could set the pails on them. That would be pretty nice to have that trailer. But I don't know. We could still keep beating on the pickup, I guess. All right, we got a lot of stuff to throw in the truck. Oh, remember this? You buy a filter, do yourself a favor and put it on there. Trust me, because these damn things, man, they will fall out. They will fall out. Put the pump back here. A lot of things to do. Hello, dude. What's happening, Jerry? How you doing? Do you know how to clean the mouse mat on a T3 something what? Um, clean a mouse mat? Like, clean a mouse mat? Clean my, I clean my mouse mat with, uh, with like, uh, laundry, laundry soap. Scrub it in the old sink with the brush. About every month or two. Is that what you mean? That's kind of a weird question, but... <laughs> I don't understand what the Trammel build is. I apologize. Holy cow for junk in the frickin' truck here, ladies and gents. This is frickin' nuts. <laughs> we got a lot of crap in there. Shopping at the Walmart. Some of this stuff is just to have on hand, you know, because you get tired of coming up here all the time. Good thing we didn't have to try to fit 10 buckets in here. Now, one more thing, we can slam that tailgate closed. Yeah, these things I want to have in case if I need them. You know, if you get the truck stuck or something happens, like, I don't want to have to, like, run on foot all the way here. That would suck. Okay, we're going to go around the corner here. And we're going to back up. Damn it! Yes, douche right into it again. Oh, you freaking bugger. Oh, good. Oh, we jack bank the trailer. Oh, we're gonna hit the pole. Oh my goodness, embarrassing. That, now I remembered everything, right? Okay, I did. All right, let's go fill this thing up. That's gonna be a lot of money there. We're still doing pretty good. We're still at 209,000. We've still got our almost eight ounces of gold. Uh, I don't want to save it. I don't know if you're telling me to save it. I got, I got too much stuff in the truck, and I don't want to corrupt the, corrupt the save here. I've heard rumor that it happened to somebody, so I'm just like, all right, let me do that when the stuff is empty. I mean, if I lose this, yeah, it would suck a little bit, but it's not the end of the world. All right, we're going to get some gas here. Freaking, this is going to cost a dick load of money. Might as well top the truck off. Not too bad. Eight dollars, all that running around we've been doing. I'm just guessing this is how this works. Now, I don't know. This might not even be the right place. Might have to pull up to that other thing. Um, this doesn't... This doesn't look good. Okay. Okay, well, that makes sense. Well, we got to put that back down. I'm going to start on the floor. Probably got to go to that one. Don't open the hood. Get in the goddamn truck. I'm thinking over here. You guys know, maybe you can let me know, but this was my thought earlier. I could be doing it all wrong. Oh, you can fill it there? Yeah, fill up the generator. If I can get to it. So this is not where... So was I missing the point? Where is it? It wouldn't make sense to like take a little nozzle filling up a big tank like this. I'm just trying to think realistically here. I know that's where you get gas and everything, but 
It just seems a little weird. Where does it go? Is it go in here? Do you gotta open the cap? Oh, sorry. Okay. All right. I missed it. That doesn't make any sense, like, but whatever. You know how many years this would... You'd be sitting here until, like, your next birthday. Um, 19000 or $1,900. Okay, 1,000 gallon. Nice. Well, she's full, too. He is full. Ooh, this would be bad. This truck would be squatting. It is squatting. Okay, we're gonna be really careful here because I don't want to have a catastrophe. I do have my diff lock on, but I don't really care. I got so much stuff here, you know, we could end up getting back there missing five things and I wouldn't even notice. I didn't fill up that thing. Yeah, there's so much junk here. I'm kind of scared to get in the back of the truck though anyway. I mean, I have to put the tailgate and you jump up there and I've had stuff fall out many times at that gas station. And so far, I don't notice anything missing. So with a thousand gallons of fuel and we still have those full gas cans, I think, back there, um, we're good. That, that doesn't take that much fuel. We were going from four 20-gallon gas cans to a thousand gallon thing. I, I think we'll be fine. I think this is going to work out okay. We haven't still spent that much of our money yet. We started out with 221. Of course, they're going to be coming to take some money from us. Wow. I'm trying to be really careful. Look at it just spinning. Nice. Gotta watch out. I always hit this rock. Okay, now we're good. Uh, no worries. Yeah, thanks again, more gaming. I, I missed it. I was looking around. I didn't see anything, but I think it was because I was holding the gas nozzle, and that's why it didn't show yellow. I think. Um, honestly, I don't really know where I want to go right now. Kind of bunch of different things going through my head um, let's let's um, mm. you know what else I just realized our tier 2 stuff is not gonna work right there that's all gonna have to get moved All that stuff's gonna have to get moved. Because that's where the tier three stuff's gonna go and it's gonna have to, it can't be there. Um, I'm setting, setting that there for right now. Yeah, we'll have to do something with that. I don't know what. We'll have to do something though. Uh, these doohickeys here, I'll probably leave those in there for a minute. Um, man, so many things. Honestly, hey, this, damn it, see, that's exactly, hmm. Throw that on the ground there. I, I know it kind of be working against myself here, but I'm thinking I might go and put all that stuff in my little shed over there. Just to kind of keep things a little bit organized. Um, cause you know, we're going to be down not doing anything with the gold for a little bit. This is going to take some time. All these power plugs and different things of different sorts. Just, it'd be better right now that way we keep everything accounted for. I think to put it over here 
on these shelves to keep it organized. God dang it, I forgot to... Frickin' parking brake every time. All right, so we got one of these cords. Okay. And, cause you know, like I said, I'm just tired of, I know we're gonna need this stuff. And it's like for a couple bucks, you know, you're at the store, you wanna get the crap. Now it's, it feels like I'm already missing something. I think we lost one of our smaller cords. Oh, it's out the front there. Come on! God dang! Oh, I just forgot going to scream. Well, that's kind of weird. There we go. All right, one, two, I think we lost one of these. Yep, we did. I don't know which one we lost. Oh, and we have an extra cord already. Well, that's okay, because yeah, we can make a long cord too. We may need that. I don't know, you know. My thinking is that big generator is gonna, gonna get us a long way, you know. Um, I want to just, oh my god, this is so, I'm unhooked this trailer. Any idea where it went, guys? I mean, if you, you know, I guess at least we made it back with this many, right? Because you need two for most things. That's going to be really difficult to see. Wait a minute. Oh, I thought I saw it. Never mind. I think it's the shorter one, too. Because when you, when you do it, you do a strap. I think, you, I think you a lot of times have to do four, don't you? I probably need to go get a couple more, come to think of it. I was thinking two, but, what I need, but no, you need to have four for, like, some of these things. We gotta go buy a couple more. I think it was one of the short buggers that we lost too. Ah, dang it. Yeah, we're setting it up. Just back from a nap, how did you get so much money? Ow, took out a loan. Took out the whole thing, 221,000. So, it was, we did a vote, we did our giveaway, we did a raffle, and then we did a vote on should we save our money and work for it or take out a huge loan and go to tier three. And they, but almost 70% went spend the money. Okay, I'm not really thinking clearly here. So um, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna fill up a few things. <gasps> hey, guess what I just found? Yay! Oh shit, the truck is rolling away. Crap. Uh, think fast. You know, that could have been a lot worse. Yeah, that could have been a lot worse. Like, we could have lost that thing on the highway somewhere. Hey, where's the Dewey Dad? I know it's over here. I'm just stuck. Holy hell, that takes a while, boys and girls. I think the gas cans are still going to be better. Because, you know what I mean? Like, not better for that, but, like, fill the gas cans up. And that way we can kind of leave this thing in place. Um, I could park it like over there and then once in a while I have to take it over here to fill that up, but you know what I mean? Because like going to fill up generators, you don't want to get the truck and have to move that around.
and having it having the gas can spread out a little bit would be nice I could put some gas cans up by the tent okay everything's good that covers on that stupid thing not smart you can hear my dad yelling get that gas nozzle out of the fucking dirt <laughs> We won't worry about the pumps right now. Oh shoot, I got that pump back there, but that's all right. They don't use that much. Uh, having that on site will be good, so we're not going to the gas station every 15 minutes. And honestly, we can probably park this off over here and do a lot of our gas can stuff from, from it right now. We'll move this thing later on, but uh, I think it'll be all right right there. What do you guys think? Keep it right there. Out of sight, out of mind. Kind of thing. Ooh, why did it turn like that? I don't like that. It's going to be hard to hook up to next time. Okay. Um, where's that little bastard of a deal? I don't freaking believe it. fell out again. Alright, it has to be over here. Gotta be kidding me, that thing is really starting to drive me nuts. Yep, oh, here it is. Yeah, this... I don't know why it did that. That's gonna not be fun. You know, you can leave the fuel cans on the gens and water pumps and you won't have to refill them near as... Oh, can you really? How the hell does that work? You just leave them, like, tipped in there? That's kind of unrealistic. I don't know if I want to know that. <laughs> Kills my immersion. Oh, don't put that back in there. We've had enough problems. Yeah, we're going to need a couple more of these. I'm going to have to get more. But at least those are back here on site. That's a good thing. Um, we go get that generator? Actually, we'll have to fill that up too. We'll have to move that. Are you guys saying get the bigger excavator too right now? Like... I need to get that. But I don't even have a dump truck. I'm not sure how that's gonna work yet. I have to use the front end loader, which I've heard does not work that great. And we're coming up to five hours here and I've gotta get running for my dinner. Um, let's go spend the money to see where we're at. So big generator. Um, I think I'll wait on the excavator and the other thing last just to make sure that we're good because that's seventy five seventy five thousand dollars right there. I'd rather get the big wash plant up and going. Yeah, I'd leave them tipped in. I know I could leave it tipped in and I'd left it, but I'd you know, the thought possibly did cross my mind earlier if that was a thing, but I just, to me, that drives me crazy. Like, no, you know, it's just weird. You know, so I, I take it back out. I'll continue to do so. I kind of consider that to be a bug and that they need to fix. I'd rather fill my stuff up. It's fun to have to stop and like take care of things like realistically, you know? If you do things unrealistic to me, it, does, it takes a little bit of the fun away. $21,000 for the Tremel. I like how you can shop and then check out. Like that is nice. Do we need all these pieces, folks? I don't get it. The TDJ, T-Rocks. The S boulders, the S rocks. 
ST sluice box. See, I don't understand this stuff. Those troughs make me confused and scared. There's the big fuel, Dewey. I don't know if you get that if you just have fuel in it all the time on site, but uh, 70,000 frickin' dollars, folks. Holy. That's gonna take our money away big time. Now, we ain't gonna have enough money to get all this. You do the math and it's not looking good. Just those two pieces of equipment right there. Which one do we need? You need them all? Have I saved lately? Let's see if we're in a good spot to save. I think we are in a good spot to save. I don't have anything in the truck. Um, yeah, we'll go ahead and save. What the frick am I doing? All right, we're good. You need them all. They're pretty cheap, so. Actually, these things should be priced higher. I mean, they're all rusty metal, but. Well, 300, I, I don't know. I think we got everything in there, did we? Oh, we didn't get this son of a buck in there. Yeah, the math is not going to add up right. So, um, and I did take out the max loan, but we'll see how close we are. Maybe we're, we'll, maybe we're okay. Uh, 224. Ha ha. Ha ha ha. Um, bop, 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 bop. Uh. <laughs> I've heard things about the front end loader not really being as good as one might think. But without it, I don't know. We do have the smaller uh, loader right now. Maybe we could use a front end loader to kind of dig into some piles a little bit and feed into that, that thing. You know what I mean? I'm honestly the front end loader I've heard not as good, but at the same time I've already got an uh the excavator. You know what I mean? I've already got it. Where is that in here? I don't even see. I didn't even add that in. Did I? Just buy it without the big gen, it can work with the small one. Kind of like the big gen idea, though. Let me tell you to get the big power, but... Do we could run everything off of it, you think? What do you guys think? You don't technically need the big power, you can run the big wash plan off the small jenny. Yeah, but... Okay, so... But isn't that going to suck a lot of juice and then we're going to be filling it all the time? Yeah, it will consume. Which one will consume more fuel? The big one? But then we could technically run more stuff off of it too, couldn't we? Yeah, I mean, because at the end of the day, what I'm wondering is how many plugins does that thing have? We didn't even add this thing in yet. Oh, look at all that there. Did they let you go inside of it when you buy it? Oh. One, two, three. Can I have work lights and a couple of machines running? Can light everything up nice. 
That's pretty nice. I don't know. That's pretty nice. I wouldn't have the front load, but if I go sell the gold that we got right now. Okay, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take the big gen out, but I'm going to, because I'm going to have to borrow the other one. Then we're going to put the small one back and we're going to get that because we're not far off. We do have bills coming out, but that'll be the next thing we purchase because I want that. I want to light the, the site up. I do want to light the site up. So we're going to take out the big power. And that'll leave us so we're not like in the hole so bad because we got bills going to come out tomorrow right away. It's going to put us thousands to pay, you know, 4000 a day. Um, now, does that stuff show up directly at the site? Because I was a dumbass earlier when I bought that excavator and I paid to have transport. Uh... But I'm thinking that wasn't necessary because if it's like the demo, the stuff shows up in there. Uh, we got to go back and get a couple straps since we're up here. Go to the, go to the Ace Hardware. Go to the Menards. We're gonna buy two more small straps, two more, two more fours, two more fives. Cause I think you gotta have four. Anything else you guys think we need right now? Did I just buy the sevens? Shit. No, these are the short ones. All right. Hopefully they all make it to the to the to the uh, claim. Hopefully they all make it. I am so hungry right now. Pick that up right there. Buckets. You need more buckets. Damn it! You already bought them all, you butthole. That's right. You need more parts? Well, I do need parts, but I figured, you know, when things break, then we'll come back. I haven't seen a lot of breakage yet. It seems like they still need to improve, and, and they're still adding on to that stuff. It's so dark, we can't even see what we're doing here. I wonder if there's any easter eggs in here, like, there's a spot on the map that has some diggable dirt, and if you go and dig there, you'll just get, like, this massive chunk of gold. I know there's cheat codes and stuff, but that's just boring, you know, punching in a cheat code and you got everything you want. I'm saying, like, if you're out there, there's a little spot where you can hit, and there's a big frickin' nugget right there. That would be kinda cool if they do stuff like that, especially if it's not... You know, at the claim site, it's like off the road somewhere behind some trees. There's no collision. You can walk back there and, and you can dig down a little bit. And then there's a big nugget in that if you put, you know, something very random. <laughs> I hope all that stuff is in the back. I can't see a damn thing. One, two, three. Mother of God. Are you freaking kidding me? First, you can't see a frick naming thing either. One of these 
one of these ones that we lost. Fell out on the fucking road somewhere. Oh, yes. Yes. Should keep it on there. <laughs> Probably caused the truck to glitch out and explode. I was about to rage. Gun rage avoided. Okay, that's just weird. Alright. Uh, let's go back and save. And it looks like we do have to pay for some transporting, huh? Unless if I'm totally missing something because it's dark. I don't see anything out here at this claim. Do you guys? So you have to go and pay for the transporting cost? But I did that automatically, assuming that I had to with the excavator, and it was there when I got back. So I'm assuming that's what needs to be done. I know if you press L, it'll give you flashlight, but then you can't pick anything up. Right? If you have that... Maybe you can. Oh, okay, that gives you that flashlight. Oh, thank you. I forgot. Okay. Because I know that... Well, what the hell is this flashlight, then? And you can't pick anything up. Whatever. That works, I guess. So, yeah, we have to do that. Should be able to do that on your pad. Oh, yeah, at the tent. Thank you for reminding me. No, that I think... I can't remember if that was... I know it was there, but I, if it was a, either you have to unlock it or it was not available yet. I'm so close to this place, I might as well just drive over and wreck... My god, don't f***ing tell me you're going to crash. I might as well drive over here and just schedule it. You're right, it is part of the tent thing. I just don't want to get all the way in there and find out. Oh. Because a lot of that stuff says not available, and I thought earlier it told me that wasn't, like, unlocked or something. Maybe it's because I didn't have anything pending to be delivered, but... I kind of want to go over here for what I know works right now. Should have done this in the first place. Yeah. Why don't they let you haul this? Maybe they do. I don't even know, but we're just going to go ahead and do this. Frickin' six thousand dollars. I want the ability to sort that out myself. I'm sorry to inform you, yes, you did win. Oh, you did win. No, but somebody else did. Yeah, the crappy load zone. I know. I thought I, would, I thought I hit my truck and it was spazzing out. I had it happen yesterday. On a save, I smashed something right away when it was saving, and it like the hood flew off. It happened the day too, but it wasn't during that the, the loading the zone. And uh, yeah, it crashed. I've had so much fun playing this game. I'll definitely be... Uh, I think tomorrow we're going to end up doing this, and I'm going to have to squeeze farming in on a special Monday stream because I kind of want to keep the ball rolling. I, I, don't, I just can't... I couldn't 
fathom the thought of even putting this off till Monday or next week. Thank you so much. Talking Tui, thank you, thank you. Very classy, classy thing to do. How many, 14 months of continued support. We do appreciate it a whole bunch. There we go. Shut the truck off. And go to the morning. Save, save, save. Save and verify. Save again. Thank you so much, Tui. What's happening? Hope everything's going well for you. Classy lady there coming in, subscribing 14 months in a row. Good to see you. Hey there, I'm still watching. Good, good, good. How's everything been going for you lately? You've been tearing up the old planet coaster and the fishing, the fishing planet. I saw you the other day on the Twitter said you were going to be playing that Don't uh, Don't Starve. Very popular little 2D game. I'm not into those 2D games. I, I go over my skill level. <laughs> I look at them and I go... Because they, there's like so many things to figure out, but they're really popular. Did you ever do the, um, since you like farming sim, did you ever do that Stardew Valley? Man, that sucker was hugely popular. I'm just one of those people, I gotta have 3D graphics. It's tough for me. My, my brain, you know, it can't comprehend. Yeah, still playing all the simulation, very nice. Yeah, the fishing is fun if you like that. They should, uh, they should do a DLC for ice fishing. Um, yeah, so here's all of our toys, folks. <laughs> uh, I was most excited about the big generator. So we got to use our equipment here to lift up on that. Um, I don't know how well this is going to work. Uh, they don't give us eye hooks on here, do they? No. In real life, you can use the hell out of these to lift stuff up. Um... Shaker table, we're going to have to pick all these things up. Uh, this is going to have to get picked up and set into place. Somewhere is eye hooks. Looks like on the bottom there. Yep, there we go there. So we're going to have to get our excavator over here. And it's going to be a hell of a load to set all this stuff up. Um... Yep, that's going to take an excavator. All this stuff has got to be lifted into place now. Definitely going to be a job and a half. This thing here, I'm, I'm worried about. This is a big machine here for our little excavator. I don't know. Oh, daddy, that's going to be... Wow. Wow, wow, that's a big plug. Oof. Heavy. That's some heavy tonnage. The old shaker here. We bought her all used, folks. We ain't got the money for the new stuff. Alrighty, well, that's gonna do that. Let's go and at least take a little rip in this thing here and go play in the dirt. I heard it's a piece of... I heard this thing doesn't work as good as you'd think. But, you know, they're gonna be updating and stuff. Oh, look at that. They actually do the little foot duties. Oh, what the hell is that cover prop like that? We go and buy this thing, spend all that money, and they give us... Well, at least it's fast. Take this thing to the store next time. Now, I'm not really expecting, like... I'm not really expecting amazing things out of this. Oh my god. Oh no! The brakes could use a little bit of improvement.
Um, yeah. Uh huh. Um, I got the new toy stuck already. Are you freaking kidding me right about now? Well, son of a cigarette. It doesn't help that I got a full load of dirt. Well, okay. This is really dick. Um, yeah, so uh, about that, what do you guys think we should do here? I can go get the, uh, I can use the excavator to pull it out. I mean, that's about my only choice is to go get a friggin' rope. I don't think the pickup's good. The pickup shouldn't pull this out. Oh, I'm stuck. Uh, yeah. Reset it? How in the hell in real life do you do that? We're not... Reset? Is that some game talk right there? Is that what you gamers do? This is real life, man. We stuck it. We gotta unstick it. Now I'm stuck. We stuck it. Now I've gotta unstick it. Um. Hmm. I just, I can see me destroying my equipment really quick here. I can see me destroying my equipment very quick. Yeah, I couldn't get backed up there. I can't believe it. Better hope you have enough wire rope to get that thing out of there. You, or are you <laughs> going to be going? Your see, uh, season's going to be going downhill quick, Mad Men. What's happening? Jesus, this is bad. Um, I read somewhere that there's a reset unstuck button on the map. There was in the demo. But like I said, that's some gaming talk right there. This is real life, folks. You are watching the real life. This is simulated reality. Here at Gunning Gamers. We stuck it. We need to figure out how to unstick it. My brakes, that that thing has really bad brakes. Ah, oh, this thing is going to get wrecked. We're going to blow some fucking friggin' hoses. Excuse my, my, my French. Oh, man, I'll tell you what. We can definitely go down more if we need to. Oh, dudes, what happened? Is this is this the Hoffman's? <laughs> yes. The drama is real up here in Porcupine Creek. Frick sakes, what are we going to do? 
think this one's longer right here. We'll grab one of these here. Actually, that doesn't look very long at all, but I think it's gonna be long enough. Just to hook one to the other, we can go down. That's a great view right there, isn't it? That's a real freaking nice view. Times are tight. Not how it's supposed to look. Um, yeah. Oh, great. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Okay, so those are not real? I'm not a real boy! I'm stuck. Folks, I am stuck right now. I don't know what else to do. Okay, we're on to something here. Um, okay, I'm still stuck. At least we moved. I jumped into a giant hole that I created. Son of a freaking balls. Literally stuck. That thing's moving. Probably from the digging I'm doing. I mean, it's not a bad thing that it's moving. It's not a good thing that I can't move. Man, when you get yourself up a shice creek without a shovel, a good shovel. I wish they had vehicle tabbing. That would make life like a lot easier. Or some way to like select into your vehicles. <laughs> oh, oh, four gets you stuck, yeah. Exactly. I'm a fighter, folks. Even though dinner's probably getting cold. Oh, I think we're, I think we're had. From the best as I can tell. Little bit of progress. That just doesn't look good. I'm gonna dump the dirt on my head and elevate myself to the next level. 
Sadly, this is working. <laughs> Fiji drinker is the Dickard Rush. Thank you so much. Eight months continued support. I'm making a sand castle. I think I'm almost there. Holy crap, I'm falling into the map. Holy crap. I'm not out of the dark yet, but I've been in here once and got out. Oh my goodness, I thought I was going to die in that hole. Alright, let's do this. How would you say, is that pretty close? No. We gotta get under that thing. I mean, that's just my guess. Hey, why can't I pick up this freaking cable? I don't even know if you can hook onto this. I'll be honest with you guys. I don't even know if this is a thing. Does anybody in chat know if that's a thing that you can do? Because, I mean, to me, it looks like it should do it, right? Farming, thank you so much. You need to reset your vehicles. You reset your vehicles. I don't know if you heard me, man. That's some kind of game talk, dude. This is real life. We don't reset. I don't want to reset it. I don't know how many times I got to say that. I don't want to reset. I want to get it unstuck. We stuck it. We're going to unstick it. And I'm freaking stuck again. God dang it. I'm going in deep, fellers. There has to be a god dang way. I just need to know, can you hook to this or not? That's really the only question. Has anybody done it? At this point, I'm going to say that even though those are there, and it totally looks like you can, it's a fail. Does that not look like it should hook onto there? I mean, just tell me if I'm wrong! Here's the hell out of you every time. I do apologize. How about the bucket hooks? I didn't see any bucket hooks when I was looking earlier. There aren't any bucket hooks. That's, that's the first thing I was looking at earlier before we even got this thing stuck. I was like, okay, where's the bucket hooks, yo? See, I don't know. They put so much realism in here, but, like, it kind of bums me out that they don't give us a way to tow with this thing. Right? I mean, there should be a way with those hooks to do that. So that's why I was wondering if somebody who's playing the game who has this, it's, it's not all dicker, could let me know. Yo, I can't get it either. That's what I'm thinking of 
of doing is maybe digging out a little ramp. I just, my problem is, is I get out of this. When I get out of this thing, I got no way to get out of this hole. I mean... Ooh! There we go. Sweet. Oh man, we're gonna make a huge mess. Why can't you hook onto the damn thing? That doesn't make any sense. I mean, right? Am I wrong? I know it's not the best place to do that, but I'm I'm kind of in a hurry. I'm kind of beyond that. I'm kind of in a hurry, so I'm just trying to... Raise that up and over. Oh, no, I got that rope dangling here. Lost the frickin' hose, folks. I'm trying to dig underneath because this is going to make it right here where I've got no frickin' chance. Trying to like smooth this out, but there's this one hump. I don't think it's gonna. I don't think it's gonna work. What do you guys think? Do you think we're on to something here? I think we I think we might be kind of Dump this down into the hole. 
I think it's time for a friggin' red eye. This, I don't even, I don't know if we've got any progress. I can't seem to dig on them wheels. In real life, you could really get yourself out of a pinch with that bucket by digging in. The bucket just has no balls at all. How do you dump this bastard? Okay, we got up, down. That moves that. Forward, backward. Um, arm up, blade up. Why? Okay. Oh, that's what I needed to do. And I'm not necessarily a big fan of that. But this will help. Now I'll keep that down. I can't even turn. Oh man, a whole day wasted trying to get this freaking thing unstuck. I don't want to be defeated. I don't want to reset. If I could just get that ass end out of there. All right, we're going to try one thing here. I'm going to jump out. There we go. I was hoping I'd be able to get out right there. I'm still salty that you can't hook a rope on. Okay, we're going to go in the outside view here. Ay, ay, ay. There's just no, there's no turning. Come on and help me! Damn you, game! I hate that when things make such clear sense, like you should be able to hook that and you can't! Unless if it's a thing, 90% of Gold Rush the show is them getting shit unstuck, pretty much. That's why I'm trying, I know I can do it, it's just how much time do I want to spend trying to get it out, you know what I mean? I know I can. That's obvious. Whether I can or can is not even a question in my mind. Yes, you can. It's just the time invested. Is it worth it? Yeah. 
in real life you could do this with your bucket walk yourself right out if you're able to tilt the damn bucket down but in here it's not really a thing how about diff oh shit yeah and you turn that on I thought I had it on hold on now I might be able to it's pretty iffy You want to keep that on all the time. I know somebody said turn Q and I'm sorry, I thought I had it on already. I don't know, what do y'all think? It doesn't seem like it's wanting to do anything. You know what I find kind of funny is how the diff lock is on, but oh, it's off again. Oh, that turns it on and off with this thing. Okay. Never you push down on the stick, so I keep inadvertently bumping it. I have a ramp behind me, but I, I just, I can't, I can't get out of that. All because the ass end of this stupid thing is stuck. See, there's a little toe deal back here, but, oh, that's for the handle. Oh my god, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Do you just suck it up, play it like a game, and reset it? Or do I take the time? You guys tell me. Do I reset it or take the time to, to dig a ramp out? You guys tell me. It's, it's, it's iffy. It's iffy. They're saying reset it. Bury it. <laughs> okay. Um, let me go over here. This is really bad. I don't really, oh man. Oh man, I want to get it out, but okay. How do you reset it then? I haven't had to do this since I played demo earlier in the year. Um, is it, is it in here? You go to here? Reset it? I only had to do this, I think, one time in the whole demo. Well, that didn't work. Looks like we're going to be getting it out after all. Okay. Is that going to... Is that... Is that... Alright. They're not very clear on this stuff. God, that kills me. God dang it. really want to dig that thing out. I know it could have been done. It's just... How much time? My dinner is an hour, two hours past been sitting on the table, so that's kind of making me frustrated too. It's really hard to get done everything you want to get done in, in this game in one, in one night. Well, good thing we didn't break any hoses. Makes you rage from the little things. 
No, I will I can't I won't be able to come back tonight, especially because we went late. I really need to get this video editing done. Um I think we're gonna end up substituting this in tomorrow to, to get the tier three stuff all set up. I've already gone way over what I thought I was gonna do today, so Oh, so much fuel we burned. Driving that thing around like that. And then I, I leave feeling defeated. But we made some good progress today, tomorrow. Uh, if we do this, if I decide to do that, because then we'll end up doing farming on Monday night. Maybe we'll, we'll get an extra stream, because I'd rather get to this first. A lot of people like myself are wanting to learn a lot, so I'd rather stay on top of it right away. Um, and it's okay. We, we've we only maybe a couple of times in the last three and a half years have done something other than farm sim on Sunday night. So, you know, it. I think it'd be a good thing. I think people that like farm sim would also enjoy watching what we're going to be doing in here tomorrow. And that's setting up all this stuff. Um, we're going to leave that there. And everything is off here. Uh, it, it's another day has gone by. We pretty much lost an entire day. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I could just not save because we saved it in a spot before I buried the thing. I think it'd be best to save. You guys tell me what you think. Uh, you know, because we used a bunch of fuel and we burned another day and another payment. Um, I think we should, I think we should absorb that. It's winter and farming, just play this, yeah. Tomorrow is winter, but we're going to be trying to do our snow plowing as well as our other stuff. So, you know, probably try the chain in the video they use the front loader to lift with the bucket. Didn't I not have the chain? Was that not what that was? I don't know any other thing. I'll have to look into it. Yeah, so I think that's what we're going to be pushing it out with the excavator. I tried to push, yeah. Tried to push. Don't save realism, you lose, you lose. Yep. All right. We're going we're gonna to save it. Because I saved at a really good spot, but we burn up all the fuel and accept it. So and I'm, that's, I'm happy with that at least, even though we had to reset. Um, we lost another day, another another bunch of bills and things like that. But it, hey, if we were just in here gold mining all the time without problems and things going on, it would get monotonous and boring. So I'm not sad about that at all. Uh, we'll go ahead, just because OCD, we'll save it again. And uh, that's going to be it. That's going to be it. All right, we're out. We're out for the night, folks. Don't forget, join us over on Discord. Love to, love to, you know, type chat with you over there. We do have voice channels. You can also join us on our TeamSpeak. Make sure you're following us on Twitter so you know exactly when we go live on Twitch. Very important. Check out our YouTube channel. There'll be more videos going up tomorrow. You can catch all of our stuff. Uh, I'm uploading all of it on there. Many, many, many hours worth of stuff. Uh, we'll be going over there, so do check out. We'll get all those links into the chat. Very important.